For any Xbox or PlayStation codes or cheap games on any platform, use the referral link in the description. It'll take you to G2A.com. Use the promo code CHEZ over there and you'll get yourself 3% cash back. For all No Identity merchandise, hats, hoodies and t-shirts, follow the link in the description down below to the No Identity Fan Fiber website. Hey guys, welcome to episode number one, a pilot episode of a new My Player series here on the channel. Uh, we're not on FIFA 18, as you can see top left, we're on Pez 2018. The My Player version of, or the My Player game mode on FIFA hasn't been up to scratch for a number of FIFA iterations now. Uh, I started it on FIFA 17, it wasn't successful, we just scrapped it completely. It went down a treat on FIFA's 14 and 15, 16 we stumbled through and 17 it failed, but 2018 I've been reliably informed, in fact over the past two or three years actually, that the Become a Legend feature on PES is better for a My Player style series than the virtual pro version of the uh, of the game mode on FIFA. So, there's a pilot episode to see whether you'd be interested in seeing this style of series return to the channel. We're going to be starting a Become a Legend series here on PES 2018 in this video. If you want to see more, then drop the video a like rating, subscribe to the channel too to make sure you don't miss out on any more. Now, I haven't gone into this mode at all now, so this is all completely new to me. You're basically genuinely getting my first reactions here. Now, match time... Uh, we'll leave it at 10 minutes, which is 5 minutes each half. Uh, difficulty wise, I'm going to leave it... I'm going to... Hmm, I'm going to leave it on regular for now. Because obviously I'm not used to the game engine. If it's too easy, I'll move it up. But for now, I'll leave it on regular. Uh, let me know what you think I should have it set at with regards to your own uh, experiences with Pez's difficulty settings. Classic players will have off, will have pounds, will have additional leagues, etc. So we will push forward. I will play as an original player by creating my alter ego. Uh, I'm English, of course, so we will set myself as such. And uh, I'll choose my player details. I'll, uh, I'll go through and create my guy off camera and I'll cut and come back to you when my man is created. Right, I've created my guy. I'm now selecting the role that I'd like to play. Now, I'm going to go for uh, an out and out striker for this series. In previous iterations of uh, a my player on FIFA, I've kind of tended to maybe be a cam or try to wing a one as well. This time, I'm going to try and be the out and out striker. I want to be the fox in the box, so to speak. So let's select that one. Uh, now my stats have been set. That's what my guy looks like on the left hand side. There, obviously made him ginger. Uh, my ability right now isn't the best. Injury resistance is three. I'm not sure on what scale that is. Form of six. Weak foot accuracy two. Weak foot usage two. It's obviously something we're going to have to work on. We're 68 rated overall. Right footed. Uh, I'm not the fastest. Dribbling of 77 is not bad. Ball control of 78. Speed of 79. We've actually got some decent stats to start off with. I'm quite pleased with that. Uh, we don't have any skills yet, unfortunately. But obviously we can develop those throughout our career. 192 centimetres tall. Uh, 77 kilograms in weight. It's about what I am in real life. So... Uh, I'm not sure whether that will drastically affect what my stats will be over the course of the save. Obviously, using my experience of FIFA, the taller you are, the slower you tend to be. But hopefully in pairs, that isn't going to be so much of an issue. Because obviously you can get quite fast, tall players. Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang, for example. So let's select a league. Um, I will play... Uh, let's start in the championship. We'll start in the championship. I don't want to start right at the very top, because if this is going to be a long-term series, we're going to want to start and work our way up and get that progression. Plus, if I'm 68 rated, I'm not really going to be starting in any Premier League side, whereas at the Championship level, I could definitely be starting week in, week out. So, uh, we'll see what happens. I don't know whether you get to select a club, or whether you have to play a trial. We're actually in a Millwall kit right now. Am I going to start at Millwall? Is this where my... Okay, I've signed my first professional contract for Millwall. Wasn't expecting that. Didn't expect to be given a club. As a Chelsea fan, not sure how I feel about playing for Millwall, to be completely honest, but we'll, we'll give it a go and see if we can impress and perhaps move on as quickly as possible. No offence to, uh, to Millwall fans. It's the 15th of August and it's the, uh, the start of the Football League season. No pre-season friendlies at all. Uh, player menu, negotiations, team info. Well, let's just... What's it say? Player menu. Preferred number. Oh, I get to select my... Preferred number. I'm currently number seven. I kind of like to be number nine or ten, to be honest. Sorry, Lee Gregory. Uh, it will take several days for. Oh, I, I have to request it. I can't just change it. Okay. 
Dear Millwall, can I be number nine, please? We'll see if I actually get gifted that. Right, well, let's forward the time. And presumably, we'll head straight into this game against Middlesbrough. Uh, no, I'm not playing. Okay, we've lost 2-0 against Middlesbrough. All right. Well, this is the league table then, as things stand right now, with Millwall being 21st. Superb. I'd like to think I'm on 180... Oh, I've earned, sorry, £182,000. I was going to say, definitely not 182 grand a week in the championship. Manager trusts me 60%. Uh, well, the transfer window is open. Player can request a change of shirt numbers. That's what we've done. Now, I'd like to play the next game, if possible, boss, against Bristol City. Now, have I been selected? You're in the starting lineup today. Do your best and good luck. Uh, I hate to be the deliverer of bad news, but the brass has turned you down this time. If you want your shirt, you're going to have to prove you're up to it. Better luck next time. Okay, so we're staying number seven for now. We've been rejected when asking to be player number nine. Not to worry. Not to worry. Right then, well, let's forward time and let's go and play Bristol City and see how well we can do in our first game. I'll only play this one game so that I can gauge your feedback. I don't want the video to be too long, so I want to get as much feedback on this video as possible. The longer it is, less likely people are to watch the full version or the full uh, video itself. But we're starting in the uh, starting lineup alongside Morrison. So ourselves and Steve Morrison up top. What are we in? A 4 4 2? We're starting up top in a 4 4 2 against Bristol City. Wish me luck. Well, here we go then. I'm kicking off to start us off, and we'll see how we get on in this first game. I've, uh, I've edited the camera slightly. It did initially start off in the kind of be a pro style camera, but I've changed it so that I'm, uh, I'm here with the full pitch at my disposal. I'm going to drift into the centre though. We could start with a goal hit. Okay, dream start. Ferguson has scored after three minutes. I might consider upping the difficulty if we're going to continue to do that sort of thing on a regular basis. We might have just been lucky and started very, very well. But, I mean, that's superb. Millwall won Bristol City nil after three minutes. I've got a throw. We've had 54% of the possession. Now, I don't yet know. Oh, he's gotten there. It's 2-0. That's a great cross and a good finish. In the 18th minute, Steve Morrison makes it 2-0 Millwall. We might well be on our way to our first set of three points in our first game. I've been involved in a bit of the build-up, but I'm yet to uh, figure out if I can actually call for the ball. You guys will have to let me know in the comments section down below. You see, just gets the run on the defender. He's backing away and then attacks it at the near post. He's done well. It's a good header. But can I call for possession? Or do I have to just be in the right position and then the AI will pass to me. I didn't want to kind of look into these sort of things ahead of time. I wanted you guys to give me the feedback so that I can uh, get you guys as involved as possible in the series. So Steve Morrison is here. So I'd like to call for it, but I don't know how to do so. So I'm just going to wait and see if the ball ends up at my feet, which it could do there. It hasn't quite. I'm pressing A to something. to. I'm pressing all the buttons and I'm not getting any uh, option to call for it. So... Uh, I'll play it around the corner here. I'll give it away. It wasn't necessarily the best, but we've won it back. Could give it to me. Has done. Morrison's calling for it and pointed where he wanted it played, so I'll give it to him. Shot from distance. Good save by the goalkeeper. Getting more and more involved in the play now. Like I say, this is a brand new game engine for me, so I'm, I'm still finding my way around the system. But I'm getting involved in the passing play. This is the first corner that I've faced or had the chance to try and do something with, and it's headed my way. I'm trying to shoot. I've won the header. Well, unfortunately, it's gone up and over the top of the bar. My first effort on goal as a professional footballer is that. So what now? Brian with the ball over the top. Taylor's in behind. Hits it first time. That was a decent effort for Bristol City. Their first opportunity downfield. Good ball over the top. And then the technique on the volley was decent. He just didn't quite have the accuracy on it. Not bad. Morrison should be up for this. He's won it. I'm here short. They've given it to me. Give it through there to Morrison. I'll push on again. Could use me, but he's dinked it out wide. I'll get myself into the middle. Cross could come in. Cross could still come in. It has. I'm there with the header this time. It's on target. And the keeper saves it, unfortunately. My second effort on goal as a Millwall player is definitely a lot better than my first. That one on target, but unfortunately not into the back of the net. A good save by the goalkeeper. Half-time, 2-0 up. Decent performance. Bristol City came into it a little bit more towards the end of the half, having that chance. But two goals for us, 50-50 possession-wise. 
have dominated the game thus far chance creation wise. And I'm still on the field. At least I think I'm still on the field. I am still on the field. We haven't been substituted out yet, although my stamina is quite low. It's going to take a while, I think, to build that up. So we might find ourselves being substituted at times throughout this save. But I'm really pleased with how things are going so far. Unless, of course, Bristol City score with this attack. In which case, I won't quite be as pleased as I was. But it looks like we're going to get rid of it, and we have done. I'm going to try and get up here and support Morrison. But Aidan Flint is quite tall at like six foot six or something like that. So they're going to get it away. Diageo here gets caught in possession, but back to Reed. Over the top out wide to Patterson. Jamie Patterson could get it into the box maybe. Has done. Cleared away though with the head, but only as far as Reed. Still danger here. Still danger here. Dowder back to Gary O'Neill. Went for the swing, missed it, and we're on the counter-attack. I just need to lay this in front of a teammate. Big ping out wide looking for Morrison, but I think that's overplayed and it is. Nice ball inside. I'm still in a dangerous area. In the box, waiting for a cross. He's coming my way again. Oh, I've missed time. I hit her. Every chance I've had so far has been with my head. Twice, I've completely fluffed it. Once I got it on target in a good save. You see me breaking around. It's good positional work. And then driving towards the ball, but I just timed it wrong. I jumped too early and got underneath the ball. And unfortunately, it's gone well over the top. Made, made 11 of my 12 passes, though. So our interlinking... Creative play has been very good. Big ball played over the top here to Morrison. Turns inside. I am here in support. Play me through. We're in. We're in. Oh, no. Keeper saved it. My first one-on-one. -on -one. I can't believe I've missed. What a glorious opportunity. Did I take it? I think I took it on my left there. Just tried to time the run right so I was on side. And it's really well played in. I took it on my left. He's done well to save that, the keeper. We're having chances. This is really positive. I'm enjoying this. Right, we've travelled... Oh, oh, I've dribbled 18 metres thus far. That's coming towards me again. Oh, I've gotten there and it's saved by the keeper again. Denied by the man between the sticks for the third time in this game. I'm playing really well here. I don't know what my match rating is. There's no way to tell as far as I can see. Or not from the on-screen graphics, at least. That's a great ball in behind, but... Will he keep it in? Mm, yes? No. Goal kick. Good knockdown. Let's pass it back to a teammate. We've gotten it again. Trying to just show some strength here. There we go. We've done well. We'll bust the gut to get forward again, but I've not got much stamina left now at all. But Morrison can play me in here, and he has done it. I'm going to try a shot from distance. It's deflected. Pisano will clear it. I've attempted a snapshot, though, and I've won some game points from it. Oh, nearly intercepted there as well. Now Bristol City on the counter. Only 20 minutes or so to go. Don't think I'll be lasting the rest of the game with the amount of stamina I've got left. You can get substituted off, of course on pairs, whereas you can't on FIFA. And we're in. We might have an assist. Williams misses the target. We could have scored. We could have gotten an assist. That's a really nice through ball. I'm pleased with that. Outside the right foot, around the corner, but Williams hits it first time. Good foot or so wide. Oh, ball play forward. I'm trying to flip this around the corner. Morrison is in. We could yet get an assist in this game. Morrison! We've gotten an assist on debut! Steve Morrison gets his second, our third, and my first assist on my debut. We'll celebrate with him. Clearly settling into the club quite well. Being accepted as part of the group. The dynamics are good. My teammates are happy to give me the ball. And they're happy enough to be delighted to celebrate with me as well. I don't feel excluded at all as part of a newcomer. Nice flicked head around the corner. Morrison sets himself up and tucks it away. 3-0 Millwall. On and being substituted off. Immediately after that, I'm being substituted off. Lee Gregory comes on for me, and I will have no further part to play. I can accelerate the match by the looks of things by pressing R1. So, well, if anything happens, I'll bring it to you. If not... Oh, I thought he scored there. If anything happens, I'll bring it to you. If not, I'll cut to the end of the game. There's the final whistle. It's a 3-0 victory in our first game as a Millwall player. And we've done very, very well there. We got the assist for the third. I don't know how I feel about the difficulty level just yet. I might up it one and see if the opposition are slightly more creative. They did have a couple of chances. They did take a, a rather rapid early one and then two goal lead. But I felt like I played okay in that. I had chances, mainly with my head more so than my feet. Steve Morrison got man in the match with a seven. I got a 6.5 though, so I was, I was actually joint second best player on the field. I'm quite, I'm quite happy with that. 
You guys will have to let me know in the comment section how you think I got on. Drop the video a like if you enjoy. Subscribe to the channel too to make sure you don't miss out on any more. That actually moves us up to 13th in the table now, which is good. Rocketing up. And the team we just played, Bristol City, dropping down. So they only had uh, they only had uh, one win so far this uh, this season as well. So they won on the opening day and uh, and we've beaten them on match day number two. Still only 68 rated, but appearances one, assists one, average rating of 6.5. I'm quite happy with that. Let me know in the comment section if you'd like to see some more. If you would, then I will put together more of this series and we'll do it as regularly as I can get it out to you. But I think that's going to bring... Oh, oh, England squad, unfortunately, we're not selected. Not surprised that I wasn't selected for the England squad. To be completely honest, I'm not too heartbroken about that. But that's going to be, that's going to be it for episode number one as a pilot episode of a My Player here or Become a Legend here on Pro Evolution Soccer 2018. Let me know in the comments what you thought. Hit the thumbs up button if you enjoyed and let me know if you want to see more. But for now, that's all from this episode. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time.